Previously. Chongqing, China. This city is Big Brother's wet dream with more than 2.5 million cameras covering 15 million people. Privacy is a four-letter word in this place. It's pretty ironic that a cloak and dagger organization like the ICA keeps its most valuable secrets here. You'll find Hush conducting his fringe experiments in an abandoned apartment building. While Imogen Royce, the archivist, runs a day-to-day -day business of the ICA data facility. I just hope you know what you're doing, 47. And now we continue. I found something. Buenos Aires International Airport this morning. Now watch this. Harold. Trail ends at the airport, but turns out that a top Providence operative owns a vineyard in the area. Don Yates, of infamous New York law firm Morgan Yates and Cohn. And get this, it's hosting his retirement party today. She's infiltrated them. She's sending a message. She needs my help. Could have fooled me. You don't know her. Anyway, if you're going after her, you'll need to deal with the Herald. Her name's Tamara Vidal, former CIA asset and political firebrand. She's a master of surveillance and the Constance's most trusted aide. She'll have eyes everywhere. You won't get far as long as she's in the game. Why are you telling me this? I thought you were out. Yeah. Old habits, I guess. Anyway, I... I need to go. See you around, 47. No. You won't. Beautiful vineyards. Hey, what? Hey, Dustin Dad here. Welcome back to more Agent 47 That's Adventures. I also know it's Hitman 3. Likes Let's go talk to her for a sec. Don't be long. Bitch, I'll kill you. So, anyway, uh. Hey. Girl. Uh, caught you on cam. You got my message. You never get caught on camera. Not unless you want it to be seen. So, what's the play? You're not the only one who's been busy, 47. I'm this close to becoming the next Constant. What? I'll be able to dismantle Providence from the inside. Only one man stands in my way. Don Yates. That weasel was the partner's legal counsel for years. He's the top candidate. But remove him from the playing field. It won't work. If Edward suspects... I will convince him you acted alone. Retaliation for Grey. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. The Herald, Tamara Vidal. She has eyes everywhere, and they're all fixed on you. The plan won't work unless we take her out. She never leaves my sight for long. Whatever your plan is, I'll help you if I can. You're sure about this? As sure as I'll ever be. All right, get her back in the game. I... Here, I got you. What? The fuck? Oh, okay, that was weird. Come find me when it's done. Oh, that was real. Is it like? Oh, hold up! It's it's getting all faint. It keeps coming. Hold up. One. Okay. Uh, huh? Nani? Wait a second. This is, is it just me or is it like? Mm. I don't know. I don't, like, I don't... I don't know, I get like so weird cause like I feel like it's lagging a tad bit. Oh gosh, but at the same we're time, give me this brick. If we fall, give me the brick. This is my brick now. Don't worry about the brick. Alright, we gotta eliminate Tara and we gotta eliminate the Dawn. Alright, let me show you guys how to how a real assassin does this. So oh they, got, oh, they really got the Von Yurda. Oh shit. Oh my oh my gosh, look at those guards. Alright, so we're not going in that way. Uh, hey, so you're in How are you? 
I need to see an invitation before I can let you right in. Right here. I got one right here. Here you are. My invitation. Everything's all good, as you can see. Good. Thank you. You're clean and good to go. Thank you. I'm gonna enjoy the party. Oh, uh, I mean, like, there are gonna be two dead bodies here, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about the body. I'll, I'll get to that later. Can okay, I slow dance? Let me slow dance. Da, 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 da. Give me, pardon me. Gonna go there. Oh, my talking right guess. there. I'm here for the tour. Do I shoot her in the face? Ah, yes. Miss Mida. My apologies. I didn't recognize you. Let me sign you. Rob you for that. Luther? Hi there. Burnwood's flying solo. I want all eyes on. Let's see what she does. And I'm Luther, to choke the fuck up her right now. What the fuck would happen? And key in on the party area. That's not too. Thin. Too many blind spots. Oh. Anyone as much as me is a weird direction. To have your way. The fuck? They're all done. And I see your tour guide is none other than Gabriel Vargas, the state's chief winemaker. Oh. Well, this is a rare privilege. You and Don Yates must be very close. So. Yes, about 400 meters, I should say. So I gotta find the head winemaker, portray myself I as him, and then give the tour. And they killed the. Uh, oh. Got a message from the boss. Do any calls? Goblin, the goblin. Did. That's right. Hey, everyone. Gates has arranged for the chief winemaker to take Burnwood and Tamara Vidal on a grand tour of the estate. Wants you to tag along. Not for my sparkling personality. This Burnwood woman sure has his panties in a twist. Wonder what the deal is. Yates's business is his business. Just get yourself ready and sign into the visitor center. Oh, I have a drink on my behalf. I don't drink. Makes me sentimental. A private tour of the estate. Diana, Vidal, and this fixer, Corvo Black. Black is a threat, but also an opportunity. Yates' own machinations are inconsequential. Joining the tour will give access to Vidal, away from the crowd. All right, so we gotta take you that out of the All right, come on, you go away. Go somewhere with not crowds. Oh, phone call. He's on the move. This is my chance. Mr. Yates. Yeah, I've got your message. You aren't telling me what I'm... Okay. Oh. Oh, oh, oh Gossas the Creek, Gossas the Creek, in the crowd. It's like a couple of spots come to mind. Uh-huh. On the tour after. Uh-huh. Oh, stand by. So you're not sure yet? Does that mean there's a plan A? Uh -huh. One where I don't stand a 50-50 chance of getting Oh, don't worry. I mean, you, you don't won't realize the risk. Here. Don't worry. Broad you won't get Workers caught. Around. Who would say? Keep on walking up the stairs. Oh, fuck. Oh, right. Just go somewhere. No, no, maybe we need to go to the bathroom. Why don't you go to the bathroom? But if I'm going to be one of these heralds, you need to start letting me in on a few things. Hello, everybody. Okay. So who's this fool guy? I'm more of a beer man myself, but if Yates wants Thank to bring you. the heralds closer together and play the modern ball, <laughs> I don't know. No, no, I'm not either, you know. I just no never framed an urban legend. Yeah. I'm, I'm a beer man yeah, myself. Yeah. I, I enjoy a good whiskey like. and a beer, although I have never actually tried scotch. I always want to try scotch. But I feel like scotch is like, yeah, I have an acquired taste for scotch. Like, like anyone can drink beer or wine, but I feel like you have to have an acquired taste for scotch. Um, yeah, pardon me, pardon me, gentlemen. I have to go. Uh, this way. Yeah, this one, go, oh, go perfect spot. Yeah, go over there. Go over there. Have fun. We got some. All right, we gotta try to be stealthy about this. Uh, uh, um. So this is happening now. <laughs> nobody saw that. Good. Nobody sees the. Oh, sh oh, oh. He might be a winner. Oh, he definitely saw that body. He's, he's gonna definitely saw that body. Sorry, dude. I can't have witnesses. Come here. Okay. <laughs> there we go. There we go. I'm gonna put you over here. I can't have any witnesses. Can't have any witnesses. <laughs> Not you too, buddy. Come on. I don't need you waking up and ruining the party. I'm on. I'm on. Come on, you're fucking heavy as shit. Oh my gosh, lose some weight. Fuck. Huh. Uh, oh, there we go. 
All right, nobody's gonna, nobody's gonna notice I just pushed a guy off a balcony. Body hit it. Nobody's gonna notice this. We're all, you know what? For distractions. Just as a distraction. I mean, like, at least I give the plants water. At least I murder a guy and then give him water. All right, I'm here for the tour. Hello, I'm, I'm here, definitely the same person. Totally here for the tour. Totally here for a tour. Why don't you, uh, why don't you set me up, buddy? Hello there, and welcome to the Yates Winery. Corval Black, I'm on the tour. Right, Mr. Black, My welcome. Girl. Miss Burnwood and Miss Vidal will meet you down by the wine fields. I trust you know the way. I can find my way yeah, don't worry. I'm, uh, huh, huh, an expert at, uh, locations. Uh-huh. Damn it, it'll, it'll come to me. It'll come to me, don't worry. I, I, I gotta get my snarpy, uh... No, they were just screaming. My, my snarpy one-liner. I'll, I'll get back to me, don't worry. It'll get back to Hi. me. Oh, 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 no, 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 stop. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Oh, no, controller, white controller! Okay, so... I actually do not know my way to the wine fields. Where is it? Down, oh, found it! Never mind. Ooh, do I choke you out or no? No, Danny, no. No, no need no reason to get murder hungry. No reason to get murder hungry. I wonder if like I wonder if like she knows it's me. Like she sees me like, oh! That's you! <laughs> like, oh, uh, uh, I mean, um uh, let's let's go. Over oh, here. here. You two must be Burnwood and Vidal. And you must be Yates's garbage room. Oh, and you must Sorry. be the chick I'm going to kill. Your name. This is Corvo Black, Tamara. He's a ICA regular. I only work with the best. Well, we're all here, it seems. Except for our guide, the chief winemaker. Looks like we're stuck here until someone fetches him. Mr. Black, I'm looking in your direction. Hold on. I'll track him down. a boy. Do try and bring him back in one Ha! Piece. No problem. Counterintuitive as that may be. What? That was a bitch. bit rude. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna enjoy and kill the fuck out of you. Alright, gotta fit the great fields. What? Oh, oh, tr oh, trespass. Oh, why is. Why is the grip field trespassing? The fuck? Why is. Tr okay. Ah, oh, here we go. Why is it trespassing? What? What is it now? What? You have some guests waiting. Senor Yates wanted you to give them the grand tour. Remember? If I don't have more important things to do than babysit Yates' socialized friends. It's only harvest season. Better do what he says, Patron. Big shot New York lawyer like that. Don't want to get on his bad side. Well, I'm not going anywhere until I have decided if the crop is right for me. Bring me the three Malbec grapes, hey, Ramon. Yates doesn't like how I prioritize. He can weigh me down with concrete and toss me off a bridge. How's that? Uh, three grapes, was it? I'll get my picking knife. So, these three grapes. So I guess I gotta like disguise myself as a worker, get the grapes, and like, oh yes, here we go. I have, I have your grapes. I'll disguise myself. Yeah, disguise myself as a worker. All right. Come here, buddy. Shh, shh. Hey, oh. Ah. oh. Okay. Um. That works too. <laughs> um. That works absolutely too. <laughs> I would plan to knock him out, but I guess. Punching him in the face multiple times works as well. And I gotta get myself a knife. Ooh, ooh, oh, oh, oh. Oh, don't need you seeing any of this. Thank you. Alright. Just cause I can. Ugh. Now I'll harvest the grapes. Ooh, actually, you know what? Oh no no no! Too risky! Too risky! Too risky! Too risky! Oh oh oh! I saw oh I saw them coming back. Ooh, that would have been trouble. Yeah, you saw the body. I was legit trying to put the body in the crate, but the same time. Oh, oh boy, not that way. All right, he does it. No, you don't see shit, buddy. You don't see shit. Just gotta get some grapes. Hey, hey, wake up. All right. One more 
grape. Yeah, one more grape. What do you, what do you see me like? Um, the fucking forty-seven doing? It looks like he's getting some grapes. Looks like he's getting grapes. Why? I I I don't know, sir. <laughs> like I I don't know. You guess his guess mine. Turn on faucet. Went around. The less people see me, the, the better. There we go. There we go. Nighty night. I don't know why I did that, but I did it. <laughs> don't know why. I have the grapes. Mr. Vargas, I have the three grapes you requested. Yes, good. Bring them here. Now, are we done here? Can you go to your. Oh, I get there looking Wait, around. Okay, I get there like, okay, who the care. fuck is knocking we people are, out? We're on. Now, let me get this break. Good size. Large yes, and firm. okay. So Don't really know that much about around. grapes to give a fuck, Excellent. but uh, go on your tour and go kill a bitch. Sweet. Okay, I'm, I'm going back to my clothes now. I got time for your. Who the fuck said you get back up? Who the fuck said he can wake back up? There we go. Who the fuck said you can wake up? Oh, another body found? Uh, good thing I'm, uh... Good thing I'm out of this bitch. <laughs> good thing I'm out of this bitch. Huh? I, I, honestly, I don't know why the fuck he just knocked out like three random people, but you know what? It's less people around for witnesses. Oh, yes, he should be coming any second now with, like, three knocked out workers. He should be really concerned the fact that why three workers just got knocked the fuck out, but don't worry about it. Hey. Huh? Um, I'm here. With the other guests. Um... Is he not coming? Is me, was me knocking out the... Oh, no, I'm about to say, like, can I just, like, kill her right here, right now? Just, like, throw something at her? Did, did me killing the fuck out of those three people, like, break... Oh, did I really just break the game? I think I did. I think I just broke the game. <laughs> wow, well, I, I think I just broke the game, because he's not... Oh, no, there he is. There he is, okay. Yo. I thought I like I thought me knocking through them out accidentally broke the game for some reason and he's like not coming. He's like, yeah, three of my workers just got knocked the fuck out. I don't think I can do a tour. Ah. My fellow wild lovers. Hello. Hello. Welcome to Vineda Yates. I do apologize for the delay. The Malbec grape. It's a demanding oh, mistress. So, I am Gabriel Vargas, chief ah, my phone. Shit, no, my phone! <laughs> <laughs> My phone was felt no! Any questions before we start? Yes, but you're not going to like them. I, uh... We're good. Lead the way, Senor Vargas. Wonderful. Follow me. Oh. These are busy yes, I always want to go on the wine-making tour, Just about even though I never actually ever in my life drunk in Great expectations. Mm. So, how do you like Argentina? Like everywhere else. Wow. <laughs> wow. I'm going First to enjoy killing you, miss. I'm really sure going to enjoy killing you. Prize winning Malbec grapes are processed. We insist on the steaming every grape by hand, which means that during harvest season, the grapes do tend to pile up. Luckily, we have plenty of storage space. Our equipment is state of the art, including an industrial sized freezer unit, and last but not least, our trusty grape crusher. Interesting. Wouldn't you yeah. say, Mr. Black? A great Follow crusher. Follow me, please. <laughs> Ooh, a great crusher. Oh, you, uh, oh I'm having Black? ideas to kill this bitch. Somehow you don't seem the type. Oh, I believe Mr. Black here is something of a jack of all trades. Yeah, Isn't that so. so? I dabble. I see. Also, let's pick up that knife. I just thought you might be let's sending pick me. Pick up this key. <laughs> <laughs> I pick up this fuel cell. Only on business. Next on our tour, the presentation is the wine goes to its primary stage of fermentation. Oh wait, I'm These having big ideas. Tanks Drown the bitch, crush the bitch. The wine to alcohol in a process that lasts between five and fifteen days. This is also where we squeeze the mass into a fine juice using our grape presser, 
for the longer secondary stage of fermentation. Ooh, that's so interesting. Now, before we move on, do any of you have questions? How about you, Mr. Black? I have a question. I have a question. It's perhaps we can take a closer look. Certainly. Yeah, Lead I want to crush this bitch. Yeah. What can you tell me about this Great device? Great pressure. <laughs> Great presser, was it? That is correct, senor. Actually, I do want to know a little bit about primary this. primary fermentation, the mass is pressed through a fine filter, leaving only the flesh and skins behind. I should add, the grape stomping, the iconic practice of crushing grapes with your bare feet, is historically red and mostly a tourist gimmick. But you are most welcome to try. Imagine you're a grape. <laughs> Thanks. I'll pass. Go on. I'll take a yes. picture of you. Oh, come on, Tamara. When yes. Let's play. all go under here. Yes. Come on, bitch. Come here. Get a little closer. Get, get over here. Get in this giant wine crushing. Get over here, bitch. Hey, queso. May I see that, Mr. Vargas? I believe I blinked. Yes. Uh, you know what? Let me check that, too. Let me go check that too. It blinked. Um, yeah, bitches. So, this is what the little guy yeah. feels like. Huh? Hey, Sir, what the fuck are you doing? Bye! No. Oh, 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 shit. Oh. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I like how he saw that shit. That's what I thought, man. You saw nothing. You saw nothing. Queso. May I see that, Mr. Vargas? I believe I blinked. Uh, you already said that, but um, I already, I already killed the bitch. But I already, I already killed her. But there's a giant blood puddle right here. Like there's a giant puddle of blood. Like, right. I love how this dude just, like saw yeah, all that shit good. and he Looks gave like zero fuck. He's like, yeah, no. What happened to your colleague? Urgent call. Urgent call. Bitch, he's Urgent dead right work. here. Oh well. Okay, so let's take care of that bitch. The next, the next one to take care of Yates is a little bit tricky. You want to do the clothing statement, because that one is the most cinematic one. I tried doing the over the top, but for some reason I, I couldn't get Yates' attention. Like, I did it twice, and he didn't come out. So, clothing statement in this. This one's a little tricky. Let's continue to the barrel room. I got scan myself as a sommelier. Which is all in the room that we're gonna go in here anyway. But I, I love how the fact that we crushed the bitch, nobody saw her shit. They're like, yeah. So, um, I'm gonna pretend it's like this dude just crushed the bitch with a fucking great crusher. I ain't gonna Ask snitch. I ain't psyche. gonna say it's about shit. It's ninety-nine percent preparation. Right. So pretty much, you wanna come in here for a second? For some reason, like we're not alerted. You wanna come in here real quick and get the screwdriver. You wanna get this. And and just for fucks? <laughs> Tier one dongle. I, I, I like I'm stealing all this shit in front of you. And you know, give some poison just for the fuck of it. Alright, so basically what you want to do now is that they're going to go and discover there's a secret lair right in there. So pretty much you can go in there, but then you won't be able to assassinate Yates. You just go and, and like nod the whole room. So you just go down here. And yeah, Don Yates. Open the vet. Come very highly recommended. Achieve with the hero. Okay. They're gonna be talking. Oh, thank you, Mr. Yates. Yeah, come to my private party. And assassin criminal way up here. Oh. Hey. Shut up. Oh crap. You have to shit, but easy. Shit. Alright, and I'm gonna scap myself at this guy. Alright, so they're not gonna see anything because the walls here are. Wait, what? Wait, how? It's blacked out! Wait, what do you mean? It's blacked out! The fuck? How, do you... how are you seeing shit? Okay, there we go. I don't know how the fuck that they saw me before. I really don't, but fuck it. <laughs> but absolutely fuck it. We're doing this again. So pretty much can't go, yeah. So pretty much I assassin create this bitch. That's assassin create this motherfucker. I just said, okay. So the body's hidden, so like, even if they do turn the shit on, 
they're gone. They're not, they're not gonna see. Oh, no, 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 get back up there. Get back up there. Uh, uh. All right, so I gotta set the lasers. So this is where like paying attention to what they say comes in. So pretty much the laser code, right? Where is it? Yeah. So it says a vintage year. The code for the laser is the same year as the wine, 1945. Yeah. Pretty much the same code. Just take the lake, take the wine. <clears throat> Hello, I have hello, head security. I um, I have the wine. I have the wine, sir. I have the wine. Yes. I... Oh hey, are you the guy from the website? Uh, oh no. Uh, okay. Uh, huh? I'm right here, sir. Sir. Sir, I'm right here. Do I really have to? Sir, I'm right. Sir, I have the. Oh my gosh. Right, do I really have to do this? Okay, do I really need to really walk all the way? Okay, hello? Like. Sir, I what the fuck? The God, like, so what the fuck? Incompetent ass bitches! Huh. Somehow I thought it'd be. Bigger. That's what she said. That's... Come on, flowers. Guests are waiting. Oh, that's fucking go. Fucking incompetent ass bitches. Incompetent ass bitches. <laughs> Let this go, Bert. Oh! Ooh. ooh! I'm killing everyone in this fucking winery. I fuck. Is gonna... Go on, get yourself patted down. We're still on alert from all those big shot CEOs oh, getting off. Oh, right. Yeah, I've heard about that. What a shame. I need to search Go you on, if you want Chris, fast. I got nothing but a gun and like a shit ton of like weapons. Stop twitching. You're not making my life easy here. Mine easier. <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> Anywho. Okay. Everything seems to be in order here. Hey, you'll get to stepping, uh, Holmes. Shit, okay, fuck. No, no, I'm, killing, I'm definitely killing you. Look, I, I'm definitely murdering the fuck out of you. So here's the deal, Flowers. The boss is having a power. Yeah, don't give me a fuck. Oh. I'm sure you figured that out already. Oh, can I poison? Oh, you can Oh, no, they're, oh, no they're, they're, they're looking at me. Okay. Actually. Hold on, let me think. Let me think. I'm like, wait a minute. Can I poison, like, his wine? And then when he drinks it, it just... Uh, 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 uh. Worry not, what? Mr. Cole. I have the... Jazar, I'm the very soul of discretion. I, I'm the... Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> never fucking mind. I try, I try my very... Like, I want... Like, you probably could do that. Be like, if you get the rat poison and ran up here fast, and then just, like, you know... Drip the white, but like I'm pretty sure he, like it's an empty glass. I'm pretty sure he'd be able to see the rat poison. Ah, and he'd be like, ladies and gentlemen, my brass? Mr. Flowers, our resident sommelier. I believe he has brought us something quite yeah. special. Perhaps you will educate us, Mr. Of Flowers. Course. This is a 1945 Grand Paladin, one of only five bottles in existence. The vintage is legendary proverbial unicorn wine. The year was hot. The wines super concentrated, and thanks to hail and frost, the production was small. Only 300 bottles were oh. ever produced. And when the vineyard was bombed during the closing days of World War II, only a single crate survived. It is said to have amazingly complex aromas with long, savory layers of fruit and spice flavors and a silky texture. Uh, Enjoy. I wonder how the Wonderful. fuck he do Thank you, Mr. All Flowers. That? Feel Just free to stick around in case our guests have questions. Quit knocking a dude out. I wonder like, this how the fuck he do any of that. This wine was gifted to me by the Just Art by Society, an acknowledgement of my firm's legal services. It stands as a powerful reminder that Providence draws its strength not from force, but from partnership. We are but a few, and yet together, we are unstoppable because we stand united. My friends, loyalty is everything, which is why 
We cannot allow traitors into our ranks. Ah, yes. Here it comes. This woman has waged bloody war on us. More than a dozen heralds and operatives dead. Your colleagues and clients, my friend, Ken Morgan. Not to mention the partners themselves, our founders, our benefactors. Make no mistake, this woman's hands are soaked in blood. Our blood! And Arthur Edwards, the new supreme head of Providence, is handing her the keys to the kingdom! Now, does that seem right to you, my friends? Does that sound like loyalty? Absolutely. Oh, I agree. Absolutely. Perhaps Edwards simply recognizes talent when he sees it. Perhaps this is why I am also in the running to become constant. And following this childish outburst, I dare say I am in the lead. Dawn. Got it. What the hell? What You're lying, of course. Which only proves my point. You cannot be trusted, Miss Burnwood. This woman will be our downfall. That is, unless we take matters into our own hands. You are heralds, sworn to protect Providence against all threats, including inside ones. I have devised a plan. Together we can make it work, but you have to decide now, my friends. Are you with me? I agree. Yes. 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 Just like that. Escort Miss Burnwood to my office. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, absolutely no, 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 no! Move it, let's go. I'm warning you, Yates. This will not oh, well. go your way. Oh, well. <laughs> you frisk me, but lucky you, I have my screwdriver! <laughs> Um, so I just wait here, or do I just... Um... We need to get our story straight. Diana oh. Burnwood died today by the hand of her rogue agent that... 47. No, it's Red Bank, it's not the change in size. I can let you go through. This I've got my order. Oh, you have to talk. I gotta, I gotta get to her. Um... Fuck, I gotta find a way, I gotta find a way to get to her. I count that in her honor. Save her. Oh, shh, 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 shh. There we go. Here it comes, well. Alright, come on, fuck on her, come on. Hello, oh, sorry, I am so late. Oh, I am so late. I am so sorry. I'm, I'm gonna go in, uh. Hey, how's it going? Hey, yeah. Fuck. Don't worry, Diana. I'll save you. Oh. Oh. Uh. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. Someone died with an umbrella today. Come on, this way. Just drop a body right here. Oh, they saw that. Took you long enough. Quick, clear the floor and get right. yourself a guard outfit. I have a guard Gates outfit. Won't be okay. long. Hello! Doink! <laughs> This is happening now. <laughs> this is happening now. <laughs> yes, it will. <laughs> yes, it will. What do you mean non target killed? The fuck? You got an asshole. Gonna dump the body right here. Uh. Yeah, I'm also gonna take this as well. And I'm also gonna take the axe. <laughs> I'm also taking the axe. Oh, and a knife. I'm also taking the knife as well. Wait, can I take, can I take, no, I can't take paper. Okay. 
Yeah, hold up. Let me, let me, let me get, let me, yeah, let me, let me get this guy too. Let me, uh, let me get this guy too. Okay, they're gonna see that shit. They're gonna be like, um, what the absolute fuck? <laughs> they're like, uh, they're, they're like dead guy on like the fucking floor. And here you go. <sighs> My trusty axe. Let me get my gun and my trusty axe. <laughs> I'm about to murder everybody here with an axe. Good. Oh, I was beginning to worry. Were you? No. Listen up, 47. Yates will be here shortly. He'll have his thug Cortazar do his Ooh. dirty work, but he won't pass up on the chance for a good gloat and a monologue. So, private space? Kill room decor? Exactly. We won't get another no, shot at this. Now sit down and blend in. When I provide a distraction. Right, blend it. Okay, so. <laughs> you just be yeah, ready. Don't worry. Let me just. Ah! Oh! Hold up. No, I'm... let me get. Let me kite. Okay, I'm gonna. Alright, let me get the handgun out. Oh, I can't use the axe too. I just want to show with an axe. Be like, uh. Hello! <laughs> oh, what the fuck? You got an axe! Rah! Like, what the fuck are you supposed to do? He had an axe. You guys have guns. Yeah, but that motherfucker got an axe. Like, I don't I don't know what the fuck you expect us to do, but he got an axe. Corvo, pick up your damn phone. Plan B is a go. I repeat, plan B is a go. Start prepping the crime scene like we discussed. Remote, staged accident. Cortazar will bring the package. Get it done. Miss Burnwood. You rolled out the red carpet just for me. Don, you shouldn't have. So confident, even in defeat. I suppose you're not used to danger, always safe behind your screens. Just tell me one thing before we part ways. Why me? Why you? Why would Edwards trust you? Please. It will keep me awake at nights, and I'm 65. I get up four times to piss as it is. Oh, it's simple, really. Edwards is proud. He considers himself the cleverest man alive, and yet we tricked him on Isle of Scale, and it's eating him up. He needs to win. Full, unequivocal victory. My recruitment was just the feather in his cap. By the way, you were right about one thing. Yeah, I'm on oh! your ears. Oh, shit. Ugh. Get up, don't get up. What are you doing, you asshole? You just stand there. If it's any consolation, Don, your instincts were dead on. I will be cursed now. And I will make it my mission to tear down Providence brick by brick. With an axe? Absolutely. Uh, oh. Such a good. Oh, I want, I want to use the axe! I want to chop his head off like he's a fucking vampire! Hide the body. Well done, 47. Better get rid of the body. Won't be long before they come looking. When you're done, <laughs> there we meet me on the dance floor. Oh, and dress appropriately. Um... Should I hide these bodies too, or...? Yeah, should I hide these bodies too? Or uh, I I guess. Okay, I I, I guess. <laughs> I guess I'm just hiding up too. Okay, I guess I guess so. Open up. Okay, can, can I drop it over here or no? Okay, yeah, okay, yeah, I can. <laughs> Yeah, nobody's gonna. Yeah, nobody's gonna notice that. No, no one's gonna notice that. And now for the peace story to start. Okay, I should probably drop the gun. <laughs> I should probably drop that. Yeah, yeah, I should probably drop the gun. <laughs> I should be having that at all. 
All right. So let me steal the calendar right here. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Take that, people. You're not gonna. Ha you're not gonna know what day it is. Oh, ho oh wait. Hold up. Wait a minute. I think there's a key up here. Think there's a key up here. Where is it? Yeah, here it is. These car keys. Lethal poison pill. You know what? Just for good measure. Just for good measure. A fucking bathroom. <laughs> Fuck your bathroom. Can I, can, I, can I leave now? Can I have his keys? Can I like use his car keys to dip? Yes, I can! Ooh, and I'm robbing your car, bitch! Okay! And I'm robbing your car! Can I get a laugh at a fuck you? Oh. Yeah, last man, fuck you, and I'm stealing your car! Fuck you, dude! <laughs> the last man, fuck you! I rock, like, I murder your ass, and I steal your car. Style of fashion. I don't know how the fuck I got that, but, like, I got it. <laughs> so, like, you killed the dude, and you stole his car at the same time. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> New personal best? Oh yeah, cause, cause pretty much I, for some reason they saw me in the last one. I don't know, I don't, I don't know the fuck they saw me through tinted glass, mind you. How did you know? Your deal. That kind of power always comes with a price. What's yours? I think you know. I am sorry. This is a necessary evil. What have you done? Eat the brand's neurotoxin. Transfers by touch. See, Edwards learns by his mistakes, 47. And as you've clearly demonstrated, brute force is futile. It had to be me. It was the only way. To get this close. My family. I know what you did. After all these years, I finally know. I am sorry. You didn't have a choice. I did. Providence used you, but I'm no better. All I saw was a blank slate, a weapon to wield. I told myself it was what you needed, but people aren't meant to be controlled. This is a kindness. Goodbye, Agent. So what the fuck is happening? What the fuck's about to happen now? Oh, we're about to find out in the next part, guys, when the story continues and untouchable. So don't forget to click the subscribe button and the bell to get a notified. Peace out, everyone. Bye.